Hi friend, David here from Learn Stage Lighting. And today we're uh, continuing on our little series here in Onyx with Capture um, and showing you some of the really cool features, how they can work together. So part of the design, the workflow that Capture offers uh, with Onyx is the ability to actually import your patch. So I know, for example, that this Capture presentation, this 4.6 training file that you can get uh, from the Onyx download site, I know that there's a version of this file that I can load right here in the samples folder that is patch only. Okay, great. But for this example, I want to show you, I want to create a blank show and, and walk you through this workflow. Um, so I'm creating a new show here. And so the workflow is like this. If you have Capture or you're interested in using it, you can be over in the full Capture program and build out your entire show. You bring in your fixtures, draw out stages, buildings, whatever you have. And the cool thing about it is you can then go in there all day long, you know, without being connected to a console, turn on the lights, make renderings, um, and sell your idea to your clients. Okay, that's one of the huge benefits of a 3D visualizer like Capture, uh, if you have clients, if you're a production company or something like that. And if that's the case, we would love to be your Capture dealer here at Learning Stage Lady Gear. But whether you have Capture or not, or you're considering it, and if you are considering it, let us know. Again, we're your dealer at Learning Stage Lighting Gear. Um, you can build out everything, patch it inside of Onyx. Oh, I didn't check this file. We're going to find out in a second. And then patch it inside of Capture, bring it to Onyx, and then be ready to rock and roll. Um, so there's a few things you do need to know. If you are, I'm going to check the universes here. The patch comes up for Capture. And it looks like all of these fixtures have what are called channel numbers in uh, Capture. That's key for importing properly. So now I'm in a blank Onyx file. And I can go to Patch. And then there's Import here. Scan over CITP. And it's going to go to the CITP connection. Again, you've got to turn this on. We've covered that in other videos about Capture and Onyx. Uh, but if you have CITP turned on in Capture uh, network settings, now you're able to go ahead, like for example, you can see if I highlight everything here in Capture, all the fixtures, you see they're not pointing straight down, they're pointing at zero DMX right now, um, which is a signal that they're not seeing data from Onyx, okay, because nothing's patched. So I go to import the patch, I see I have fixture IDs here, again in Capture, that's called the channel, so you have to set a channel for every light or else they won't import into Onyx. But then you get everything, right? Because Onyx and Capture are using the same fixture library and they have for a couple of years now, past uh, 4.6, I believe. Um, that means that your fixtures are always going to line up and work perfectly from Capture to Onyx. There's never going to be any mismatches there because they're coming from the same source, okay? Um, so here's all of the fixtures that are in there. I can literally hit, I can, one is I can select fixtures and import selected, or in this case, I can import all. This takes a couple minutes, go grab that cup of coffee, grab a drink of water, something like that. I got something here. This is a process that's a little bit slow, um, but it goes through, patches all those fixtures. Now, in my Onyx patch here, you can see, I've literally got the entire three universes that are over in Capture. And now they've pointed straight down in Capture. And also in my 2D plan view, I have a Capture top view that I can scroll out and get. And I have a Capture front view that I can scroll out and see. Okay, they don't always look perfect, but they're a great starting point. And so it's super cool because I don't know about you, but obviously I've been doing lighting for a minute or two. Um, and, and, you know, for years and years and years, if you pre-visualized anything or whatnot, you know, you would patch it in the pre-visualization tool, work with that, and then patch it again in the console and, you know, print out your patch and patch everything, uh, you know, fixture by fixture into your console to build a new show file. Um, now that's simply not required. And, and this function, um, it's not just for new show files. Okay, this will work with any show file. Okay, as long as the addresses don't overlap, right? Or else you'll get an error, you'll have to work through that. But you can literally bring in a house rig, you can use a template file, like I advocate, I recommend doing in Onyx, and then add to your template file by patching in new fixtures from 
capture. Um, so this is really, if, if you use previs and if it's something you use, whether you're trying to uh, show clients or what have you, um, it's just a really great way to be able to unify these systems and save yourself time, save yourself frustration by importing that patch and also getting a really good start um, on your 2D view. So that's all that it is. It's really that stinking simple. Again, guys, uh, if you enjoy this channel, uh, be please do subscribe. We're trying to grow it here. Our Onyx channel here from Learn Stage Lighting. It's all Onyx all the time. Uh, sounds like a radio station. And if you need to get any Onyx hardware and you're in the US or a capture license, hit us up at Learn Stage Lighting Gear. We would love to help you. We got all the stuff on our site. You can add it to your cart. You can add that to a quote and request a quote from us or just buy through the site. But we would love to be your Onyx and Capture dealer. Um, ultimately, that's what allows me to do this channel, allows us to do this channel and fund it uh, is having that ability, giving us that time uh, through those sales. So we would love to have you as a customer. Thanks so much and have a great day.